this is my relationship with conspiracy theories. On like, I'm not a conspiracy theorist guy, but you don't believe in any conspiracy theory? Like, not any conspiracy theory? Like, you think the government is telling us 100% the truth? Like, all of that stuff, they're like, yeah, the government, uh, the guys that go up there, make speeches, uh, have donors, and have to say certain things to keep those freaking donors. Like, you don't think that those people are not lying to us a little bit? So I believe that there is merit into having conspiracy theories, into believing, like, some deep state nonsense. I'm not saying it's valuable. 100% of the time, I'm not saying I mean, it's right I, all the time. <laughs> I, I, I would, I'd see someone, I'd see, like, the, the government being 100% honest with the people. Uh, if you think that, I think that's just a conspiracy theory. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> that, that's probably yeah. just a, that, a conspiracy yeah, theory. Yeah, yeah. There isn't there is a certain area that I kind of agree with like ignorance is bliss like there are things that I won't bother with in my life because it's not worth my time there's nothing I can change about certain things but at the same time there's a certain level of ignorance that's just stupid like if you truly do believe that the government is 100% there to protect you my guy like what you've been living on you've been living under a rock no as a man uh, <laughs> as a man as, as, as an agent of the state i have tyrant to say everything devil that the government says is absolutely Hitler. true you can trust us and we are here to help well, charles will not be uh, returning for well, future I, 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 well honestly i have no reason to to doubt mikey so no yeah the government's always honest yeah this oh, cigar okay. is brought to you by your taxpayer dollars. I Thank know. you, Joe. Yeah, yeah. Thanks, Joe. Well, used to be, well, to be fair, thanks, the, Grandpa Joe. Just to like err on the side of caution for this, like <laughs> the whole basis of QAnon, like the people who truly do believe in QAnon, they're grasping for like they're grasping for straws at that point. Yeah. It is a whole basis of very flimsy evidence, right. and ba- and, like, and it's also a bunch of people who think that Trump is the new savior, that Trump is going to be the one that uh, saves America. Look, <clears throat> my, my, Trump's a funny guy. I uh, you know I'd even I'd share I'd share a beer with him oh, you know, uh-huh. but <laughs> man I gotta go to, the bar to say yeah. to say he's my savior wow absolutely not no yeah. guys you know, it's funny enough because I, I dated someone who was kind of of that mentality of the QAnon the QAnon really the QAnon mentality I thought you were gonna tell me you dated Trump I'd be like that's impressive <laughs> <laughs> impressive <laughs> but that's based that's based <laughs> no. But here's here's what's ridiculous is many people that subscribe to those conspiracy theories they'll be like oh no no listen I'll show you the video that breaks it all down this video's got like four views and yeah. it's one of our episodes actually <laughs> I was actually about to say no. <laughs> subscribe to our OnlyFans and check out that video <laughs> I was actually gonna say wow has less views than our stuff <laughs> wow oh god the QAnon people have more subscribers than we do well there's also a conspiracy theory that Hillary Clinton died a long time ago and that she's still kicking around because that, there's a clone of her that woman would never die it's it, the people who live off of spite live the longest <laughs> oh my gosh Jeez. she is ridiculous yeah. and these are some weird conspiracy theory. Seriously. Well, yeah, everybody's actually <coughs> dead. I don't know. I don't know if you knew that. I'm Everyone's dead? just dead. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> we're, we're just reanimated corpses. We yeah. are actually, everyone on this podcast is a clone. It's true. Mm-hmm. It was no made real. in Jacob's computer. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> this was for no real reason because no one watches this podcast anyway. We're just made up of a bunch of zeros <laughs> after, and after, ones. Sh- after talking about conspiracy theories, we're, we're never going to get viewers or subscribers right. ever again. I believe <laughs> that most people believe the conspiracy theories they do because there always is such government resistance yeah. on certain conspiracy <clears throat> theories. Like, what is it? Uh, Joe Biden's son's laptop thing. That was supposed to be a conspiracy theory not too long ago. And, and then is. after uh-huh. a while, they just kind of had had to admit it like, <coughs> oh i guess this isn't a conspiracy theory so we'll just report on the news it, so there is a reason why people have these conspiracy theories because the government has a fact. tendency to like yeah to hide things and that is fact now the like, thing about it is not all there are plenty of conspiracy theories in the past that have been revealed to be true such as uh the mk ultra project yeah which what you don't know about that dude i, don't, I actually don't know about that one so <laughs> that okay i think you may know once i start talking about it but it was a theory Maybe. about uh government brainwashing they had all these uh um subjects kind of just tied up they were uh feeding war propaganda to them mm-hmm. giving them uh high doses of lsd and trying to basically see if they could successfully brainwash people and this ended up actually being a tr- something that was proven true and ultimately mm. bill clinton apologized on behalf of the u.s government. Oh, he apologized wow okay. kind of guy. kudos yeah. to but him no, this was an experiment that the government actually performed on American citizens to see if brain control, if mind control was was a 
was a plausibility. Wow. Cool. Mainly for uh, purposes of war, but uh, interrogation dude, and stuff know. like that. And, and that's yeah. that's the thing. That sounds crazy, and the fact that that's true. Honestly, I can understand why some people would believe crazy conspiracy theories. No, yeah. Such as Pizza Gate. I actually didn't know yeah. that was true. That's that, nuts. No, that was <coughs> actually true. That is genuinely nuts. I did wow. not know about that. <coughs> so, what He's the my heck? hero. Look, like, look up MK Ultra right yeah, now. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Jamie. Yeah, 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 thanks. You yeah. know, honestly, I, I think Joe. I think we could really learn a thing or two from from Mr. Clinton. MK I mean, Ultra. I, I think th- that's the future. Like, true, yeah. look seriously. If, if, if people disagree with us, we mind control them. Yeah. <laughs> so, sorry, Maybe. didn't 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 mean to. Oh, okay. So MK Ultra project. MK Ultra was an illegal human experimentation program designed and undertaken <laughs> by the U.S. Central Intelligence Agency and intended to develop procedures to identify drugs that could be used during interrogations to weaken people and force mm. confusions through brainwashing and physiological torture. Wow, that's mm. public information. Yeah. Probably that was like that, it wasn't you know? public information for Whoa. a bit of time. But. That was it's that's this started in 1953. Yes, goodness, this, this was, oh. this was, it would be so nice to be able to say, yeah, no, these uh, you QAnon uh, conspiracies are complete crap, and not have the government immediately turn back around and lie about something that's like, yeah, I mean, it's it's like what why 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 are you why are you lying about oh, this? Oh yeah, like to, it's nuts. The, the <coughs> government is, they're they're not really helping their case a lot of the time. No, not for at all. No reason. It, this for is no reason. Th- this is why I really think the government should start um, hiring car salesmen. <laughs> uh, you know, for you know, to, 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 to handle their PR. You thought that you were do- going strong with lawyers. No, you need to. You <laughs> no, need no, to no, push no. It, just seriously. Push it. No, no. <laughs> Uh, President Biden, sir, well, actually, you're not going to be able to decipher any of this because you know, whatever. You'll forget about it. You'll forget about it. But government, please, honestly, just start hiring car salesmen to handle all PR stuff. All press releases, everything. They will get the job done. Their lies will be so believable. Yeah, seriously. I, you'll, I, they'll get the job done.